What is up YouTube? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 15 Ultimate Team Head-to-Head -head Seasons game. And guys, as you can see, we are in the wild card round of the playoffs. A little bit embarrassed to be playing in the wild card round. I cannot lie to you. Uh, typically, I'm not there. Typically, I'm going to be in the, you know, getting that first round by, but we had some connection issues and that kind of thing, which kind of cost us a couple of times. So unfortunately, this is going to be a wild card round game, but we're going to try and play this thing just like it's a divisional round playoff game. Going to play it hard and tough. My opponent's team wasn't spectacular, but he did have the 95 Keekly, the 95 Peyton Manning. So pretty solid there with those two players, if nothing else. And then, of course, he had Lawrence Taylor and that kind of thing. So not a bad team to start things off, though. We are going to take off with LaShawn McCoy down the left sideline. Hit him with the first spin move. Hit him with the second spin move. That was delicious. And, guys, we are in good shape here at about the 20-yard line to get things going. Oh, but we take a sack there. Charles Johnson just busted through the offensive line easy peasy sack in the backfield next play Luke Keekley makes a nice tackle and we lose even more yardage third and 17 now and I'm thinking maybe I'll just play it conservatively and just try and set up a more manageable uh, third down but or fourth down but unfortunately we missed that pass to the middle over the middle to the tight end and it probably could have been intercepted uh, it did hit my player in the hands and it was dropped but uh, either way, though, we are on defense now after a field goal. A little bit disappointed to start the game off with a field goal. But our defense is playing well to start things off here. As you see, we make a tackle in the backfield there, setting up a third and five. Third and five now, and he is going to throw the football here over the middle. Oh, Devin McCourty, you're killing me, Smalls. You got to come up with that. Fourth and five, and my opponent is going to go for it, and unfortunately, we are not able to knock the ball away. A risky throw there, but it was complete, and unfortunately, we now we are in a tough situation because my opponent is moving the ball down the field slowly but surely. A two-yard gain on that little crossing pattern, but another one here picks up a first down there as we make the tackle after the first down. Devin McCourty finally makes a damn tackle at least. Tom Bahali hits his running back really hard there. Probably could have been a forced fumble, but it wasn't. Now watch this. I thought I was going to intercept the ball there with Vince Wilfork, but unfortunately he completes the pass, and then I accidentally hit him out of bounds to give him 15 more yards. As you see Devin McCourty missing a tackle there. He is just a detriment right now on defense, guys. Absolutely brutal. I don't know what his deal is. First and goal now, and he is continuing, guys, just to drive this football right down my throat, running the ball here. Fortunately, we do finally make a tackle in the backfield. Sets up a third and goal here, and he is going to throw this thing right down to the goal line. Fourth and goal now, and again, he's going to go for it. Look at this. Should have been able to make the tackle in the backfield, but Eric Reed misses the tackle. Oh, my gosh. I saw that coming and everything. Oh my gosh, I was so pissed. I, I mean, I feel like there were multiple times on that drive where I should have been able to stop him, and I just the game just didn't allow it. The drop uh -oh, kick, the missed alert. tackles, uh, the, everything. It's just brutal. And now I'm raging, and of course I throw this interception right to Luke Keekley. He usered that one really, really well. I cannot complain about it. Great play by a, my opponent there to get the football back for his offense. Already up 7-3, to three, and I, I'm in trouble, guys. I can't lie to you. I, I feel like I'm in bad, bad shape here. But fortunately, we do make a nice play there. Set up a third and 11, and my opponent is going to keep the ball in the air. Gets hit as he throws this one. Probably could have been intercepted. Fortunately, he finally did punt. So I got the ball back with the potential to go up in this game. After an interception, after a bad play on defense, we still have a chance. Retard alert, class! Yeah, but I throw another pick. That one was just brutal as well. Right over the middle into triple coverage, really. Double coverage at least. I uh, did not need to throw that. I don't know what I was doing. I don't know what I thought I saw, but it was definitely not there. So my opponent is back on offense in good shape here as he dumps the ball off here to his running back. I believe that's Jamal Charles. Probably could have been hit with another 15-yard penalty there for hitting him out of bounds. Thankfully, that didn't happen. So we are here at a second and 11, and this counter play nearly cost me. Devin McCourty finally makes a nice tackle there, hits him with the hit stick. He runs the exact same thing again, and we lay him out again with McCourty. Fourth and two, and he is just going to pick this thing up, going right over the middle there. Right up the middle, I should say. Next play, it is going to be a pass over the middle into coverage. No interception. He gets another touchdown. 14-3 to three to end the half. And yeah, first play out of the half, guys. It is another touchdown. 
Oh my gosh, could this game be going any worse for me? I'm, I'm just wondering if that's humanly possible as we get the ball back and miss an open receiver there with Randall Cunningham. Foot down and everything. I, I mean, I just don't know what to say. It's just things just aren't going your way sometimes in this game of Madden. There, there's just certain games where it feels like you just cannot do anything. As I'm trying my best here to move the football down the field. This is probably about to be my most effective play uh, in quite some time here with that nice little screen pass to LaShawn McCoy. That screen pass, I saw that it worked once and we're going to go back to it later in the drive here as my opponent gets that morphing animation. Here's that screen pass again. We hit him with it one more time. Great block here by my offense and we nearly break this thing for a touchdown but unfortunately it didn't happen 3 to 21 remember guys and we're getting down here nearly into the end zone with Denard Robinson there and he is just going to commit on the run here right up the middle sets up a third and goal and yeah come on you you're gonna have to sit in the dunce chair we're gonna throw our third interception of this football game every single bad pass that I'm throwing is getting intercepted yeah, and look at that. My opponent just lobs it up into coverage, and there's just nothing that I can do about it. Absolutely brutal, man. It just feels like there's just games like that where you can play your best, and your players just will not do what you want them to do. Chris Harris should have been able to at least get a hand on that, and he didn't. Finally, though, we get the interception with Thomas Davis. He goes to the well one too many times, and we are able to get the pick six here. I'm not going to flaunt it. I'm down multiple scores. I'm not going to run in there and, and jump into the end zone or anything like that. There's no celebrating going on in this game, guys. But there's 340 left, down only 11. I still have a chance to come back in this one if I can do my absolute best. We get a sack, setting up a third and 22. And look at this. I know the deep ball is coming. I know it's coming. I've got multiple guys set deep. And yeah, we're still going to get beat deep. Unfreaking believable, man. Like, it's just crazy how easy it is to beat deep coverage in this game. It's absolutely glitched, I swear. Three guys deep. We have a three man deep zone, and he just crushes it with a simple Hail Mary. And that's his running back, by the way, against my safety. Going over the middle, deep over the middle, making a nice little rocket catch over the middle of the field. Oh, gosh. Third and goal now, and he's going to set up a screen pass here. We make the tackle, and I was pretty happy about that because uh, I had a chance to come back, but really just not enough time. A minute left on the clock, and uh, we just weren't able to do anything with the football, so that is going to do it in this game, guys. Unfortunately, I am going to exit the playoffs in the wild card round. Couldn't really do a whole lot this game. Really frustrated, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. Sorry again to disappoint you guys, but again, I really hope you enjoyed the video anyways. Thank you, and I will talk to you guys again soon.